a couple years ago. Hey, Jeff Wall. It's one of my songs. New song day. You know how this shit works. If you've been watching this long, you figured it out by now. And you're smart. At least I hope you're smart. Uh, several years ago, a couple years ago, I don't remember how long ago. I don't remember much about yesterday. But I was in uh, Covington, Kentucky, just across the river from Cincinnati. And it was just before Christmas, and the, and the big company I worked for had bought this small company, and uh, and we were going up there to shut the plant down, because here's your Christmas present. Get the hell out. We bought your plant. Y'all are fired. It wasn't quite that bad, but that's how it felt to me. I mean, they got severance packages and all that other crap, but I had to go up there and felt a little uncomfortable. Uh, because I still had a job and these people didn't. And we're in a we're in a van. There's a half a dozen of us and we're having to go do a bunch of different stuff uh, before they shut their plant down so that we could move it down here in Carolina where I'm at. And and I'm driving the van and uh, or I'm riding, I can't remember exactly how it went. But anyway, it's just before dawn and I'm watching shift change of the street people. Oh, uh, I'm seeing dope dealers and hookers and all them other folks that, uh, and they're all heading in for the day and doing whatever, you know, Wino's doing whatever it is they do when daylight comes. And uh, and I got to thinking, uh, if I was homeless, I damn sure wouldn't want to be homeless in Cincinnati. They got an interstate to here. I'd figure a way to get the fuck out. I'd rather be homeless in like Mobile or Miami or somewhere where it's warm. Uh, and I got to, uh, uh, a buddy of mine, Patterson Hood, we were talking about a song he wrote once. He said, you know, the thing for him is to try to put himself in somebody else's place and, uh, and try to write a song from that perspective instead of it always being about him. And so uh, I got to thinking about being homeless, you know, being drunk, mentally ill. And uh, which is really not that far of a stretch for me, but uh, my dog needs to go outside, so I gotta stop. I'm back. I got two dogs, they're Jack Russell Terrace. And come on, Bob, you can get up here if you want to. Are you, you gonna stay there? Or you go up here. Come on. No, don't get behind me. Don't get behind me. Get beside me. Get beside me. Right here. Stay here. All right. Say out of Bob. Uh, they're Jack Russell Terrace, and they're getting old. And it's past Bob's bedtime. He's not happy that I'm not in bed yet. Or actually, he sleeps with my daughter. He's not happy that she's not in bed. So Bob has to be snugging with somebody at all times. And I'm lucky. He likes me. But Bob likes everybody. Anyway, let's get back to the story. Cincinnati, homeless. I don't want to be homeless in Cincinnati. And I got to thinking what it would be like to be there. And I was able to write this song. It's the only good thing that came out of that weekend. Lost in a strange place, sleeping on the streets. Had too much to drink again and not enough to eat. Now I've been drinking whiskey, trying to forget. Trying to drown a memory. I 
wake up every morning with the voices in my head Saying it's a pity that you didn't wake up dead Death is not an option, free me from this curse Living with my guilt and shame, it hurts a whole lot worse. And I've been drinking whiskey, trying to forget. Trying to drown a memory, but it ain't happened yet. Lord, he would forgive me, and you'd forgive me too. Then I'd have to forgive myself, and that's something I can't do. I belong in prison, I gotta do my time. Got to serve my sentence Locked up in my mind And I've been drinking whiskey Just trying to forget Trying to drown a memory But it ain't happened yet And I've been drinking whiskey just trying to forget Trying to drown a memory But it ain't happened yet Trying to drown a memory But it ain't